okay guys it's me imath so today in this video tutorial we will learn about how to make a simulation of distance sensor with data of arduino nano the simulator which we are using is the wokfi online simulator so let's write wokfi in the google and it will lead us to the simulators web page so this is our wokfi.com page click on it and now you can see that wokfi used to offer us a lot of microcontrollers like stm32 esp32 pi pico and arduino so we will click on arduino one within the arduino uh, we have a tiny 85 arduino uno mega nano franzino okay so uh, we will just click on this arduino nano Now here this is our microcontroller so we will go and we will take our distance sensor that is sr04 okay the, which is actually ultrasonic distance sensor now it has four pins that is vcc ground trigger and echo so we will attach our vcc symbol with that of its uh, vcc pin because obviously an electronic component need a positive power supply okay P positive voltage on the vcc and ground on the ground pin so we will go and we will take ground as well so this is our ground uh, what about its trigger pin so we have select the trigger pin on pin number nine so we will search for our pin number nine so i have it aged out uh, what about the echo pin echo must be on pin number eight so i will just connect down like this okay okay now okay so this is our circuit diagram now we will move towards our coding and here before going in wide setup or wide loop functions first we will declare our pin name so we have write int yeah, if you don't know about the integer data type or in you have to google it out or i will just tell you that uh, uh, this is our variable declaration technique that if you want to store some integer type of data in certain uh, memory uh, variable okay then we we have to write this int so i have written here int then i will write trig underscore pin now what is this now we have declared a variable okay which is actually trigger underscore pin you can write any other name of your own choice here okay in trig pin is equal to nine so what it means that trigger underscore pin is our variable and inside this variable it is uh, written nine okay so wherever in the program it is written trigger underscore pin it just represents nine which is actually the pin pin of arduino nano then we will write int echo underscore pin is equal to eight int echo underscore pin is equal to eight means that uh, pin number on pin number eight it is uh, echo or echo pin is connected r okay so uh, we have declared both of our pins now we will declare two variables okay so we will write float duration dura underscore ms okay and comma test underscore cm okay now what are these actually so float dura underscore ms comma test underscore centimeter so these two variables are actually the float float type variables in which we will store duration okay duration of our like signal and the distance value which is in obviously in centimeters so this is our 
these are our two variables now we will go to wired setup and in wired setup first of all i will write serial dot begin 9600 this is 9600 means that our serial communication has been initialized now we will go and we will we will write pin mode now we will declare pin number or trick underscore pin is input or output okay trick because obviously the signal has been given from arduino to the uh, what's called as the uh, from the arduino to the distance sensor on the trigger pin so we have to declare trick pin as output and trick pin is actually our uh, what is called as the uh, like a it is it, if, if in the sense of like sonar we can say that it is our our transmitter pin okay trick pin so we will write output and uh, what about the echo pin and echo pin obviously is the receiving pin so we will write here echo underscore pin comma input echo pin comma input so we have declared our echo pin is as input now we will go in while loop and now we will give a trigger or uh, pulse okay on trigger pin so for it we will write digital write digital write is our function which will set any gpio high or low or send like 5 volt or 0 volt so it is digital write trig underscore pin comma high trig underscore pin comma high digital write trig underscore pin comma high in delay of microseconds 10 okay and then okay and digital write trick underscore pin comma high and here we will write trick underscore pin comma low so what is this now we have set trick underscore pin high for just 10 microseconds and then we will make it low okay so so it is a just signal for about like 10 microseconds now after this has been done we will because now this sonar or distance sensor has sent some ultrasonic waves and then after uh, touching the target they will return back and then it will be received via receiver okay and, and sent to the echo pin okay so on echo pin of the sensor our arduino will like read the uh, data so here we will write dura underscore ms so what is this because we we have this variable in which we will save our data of uh, duration so here it is pulse underscore n and here we will write echo underscore pin comma high now we will set our echo pin as high so that it will and after this has been done pulse in the function will actually get the signal from this echo pin and then uh, it will give us the duration of return signal that how much time it has taken so duration underscore ms now it it also uh, we also have dist under dist underscore centimeter because we want distance in centimeters so it will 
our there's one factor that is 0 0.017 multiply by dura underscore ms okay so after uh, this uh, multiplication we will get our distance we will get our distance and then we will print this distance on serial dot dot print ln serial dot print ln and here uh, we will write the uh, distance okay the distance and this like this and after here we will write serial dot print ln test underscore centimeter and after after uh, like uh, after a serial printing of this distance we have to write delay of 1000 microsecond which is actually a delay of one second so now we will run it out now it is an online simulator so it can take a little bit of time so now there is a little bit difference but still it is okay our at least our sensor is working properly okay and if we just use to like uh, like here we will write plus two plus two then it is uh, obviously it will it will be more accurate now so it is 106 so yeah now now 197 and then 317 yeah so it is now a little bit closer more closer so in this way you can interface the Arduino nano with that of distance sensor that is sr04 so hopefully you got the concept so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe